subject here, Yes, right? yes, yes, which is? Which is our universe. Our universe. Absolutely. Why don't we? Why don't you tell us what we're going to talk okay. about today? So the Mandela effect. I don't know if you guys have heard oh, of that. Yes, yes. The Mandela effect, merging timelines and ancient aliens. Mm -hmm. So the Mandela effect for you, if you don't I just know, just find out what this was. It's really, it's yeah. really interesting. Yeah, and there's like a real like ph phenomenon behind yeah, it. It's yeah, not it's, just it's like huge. some it's weird not thing. Even yeah, it's like okay. So the Mandela effect is a pseudo scientific belief that some differences between one's memories and the real world are caused by changes to past events in the timeline. So many Mandela effect believers believe that it's caused by some type of accidental travel going from one universe to the other. So it was named after Nelson Mandela, whom some people believe that he died in prison in 1980. So crazy. But he actually died in 2013. And let me tell you, people are like, Swearing up and down that no, they no, no, remember. Like, they're like, I saw it yeah. on, I saw his funeral mm -hmm. on TV. I saw a headline article. Yeah. He died. Like people really, really have memories. More of, than one person. Yeah. Thousands of people. Mm -hmm. That's thousands yeah. of people truly believe that this man, and they, and they have similar stories. Yes. They have similar things. And they all things, say the same thing. <laughs> exactly. Similar, like I saw the funeral on TV. Like. That's just so weird. It you never know, happened. Exactly. And that, and like. Exactly the whole thing. Not more than one person. That's what's even quite you know crazy. Not just two or three. Like a lot of people. A lot of people. And they're like you know some some like psychologists are calling it like mass you know basically some type of mass hysteria where people th think they you know like they follow the leader or you know and it's just kind of you know false memories of some sort. Mm -hmm. But um, I don't know. I just I just think that one. I, I can understand like maybe their neighbors or like brother and sister and like oh I remember the purple blue you know the purple birth cake we had and. You know, when we lived on this street, but like exactly, we're gonna all have like false memories yeah. because it's really our own perception of that experience. So like, there's always gonna be little things here and there that mm -hmm. we're gonna forget. But for like half of an entire nation to okay. literally think that this man died when that never happened, and they weren't around each other, exactly. scares me. Yes, <laughs> because because that's something How that you that can't happen? you can't answer. Exactly, there's no answer. And then we don't that happen. How does I that happen? Know. So. People believe that people that believe in the Mandela effect, they believe that it has to do with parallel universes. Yes. Time travel. Yes. Aliens. Like, yes. Like, okay, one theory was mm. the time travel was basically like maybe we were we were in another universe that had something like that happen for a moment or some of our other universes collided. Like literally within like 24 hours, like so you live your whole life. And then you kind of just escaped this universe for a day or something. And you have no recollection of that. You have no recollection of actually like. No. And the weird thing is, too, is like, how did all those people experience the same thing? If it was like one weird, unique thing where the universe and some planet kind of collided. So it did this like weird bang or whatever. Like, it's only a certain amount of people. So were they like on this side of the world or something? Yeah. I don't know. It's just weird. And then they're saying the old ancient alien thing theory was like. There was like these um, aliens on another parallel universe that like basically have are like puppeteering. Yes. This? Oh my god! It was just kind of crazy. Yeah. It's some, I mean, here's the deal. I, I don't know anything. This could all be real. You know, I could be sitting in a spaceship right now, and you don't even. You know, what I'm saying like we don't really know. We could be in the matrix, right? Exactly. In this so, and I mean, we are here trying to wake you up. Yes, because <laughs> seriously, like, I mean, yeah, this stuff is. So, like, you don't learn about this in school, you don't, people don't talk oh, about this on the yeah. TV. I, I just learned about this, like, yesterday. Yeah, but it's like, whoa. I didn't even know the Mandela effect was, yeah. like, real. And there's some things in there that I've even, like, was freaked out about. Oh, let's get into it. Yes. We're actually going to play a very fun game. <gasps> okay, oh my gosh. Here I go. found some things, This and to explain the Mandela effect on a, on a more, scared. like, generalistic <laughs> way, in a way that you and I, as well, you know, you, all of us can understand, as the very things we're going to bring up things in pop culture, that have kind of been a little weird. Things that are a little unexplained. Yeah. So I'm going to pull it up for you guys to see as well. And we're going to play a game with Karen. We're going to see how much that she knows. Oh, God. We're going to see what she knows. Nothing. No, okay. Okay. <laughs> All right, Karen. Yes. Now I need you. Okay. To not look. I'm not looking. Where am I? Where? where? Okay. <laughs> Don't look at the at the side of this screen. Okay. Okay. Well, okay. <laughs> okay. I'll pretend you're not here. Hello, people. Okay. <laughs> You guys can all see that. So, what is the name of the TV show? Is it Sex in the City or Sex and the City? Sex in, in the City. Sex. In? I-N? Yeah, Sex in the City. You would be incorrect. It is Sex and the City. Look at her surprised face, people. 
<laughs> Wait a minute, sex and the city. It's sex and the city. But what what kind of sentence is that? Is that a real word? I mean, is that? Yeah, it's, oh, it is? it's a TV show. I know, but it means sex and the city. Yeah, it's that... like the city of New York and sex and trying to get sex and trying to live your oh, life. Well, I thought you'd be having sex in the city. You know? No. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay, that was weird. Sex sorry. and the city. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay. We so all remember it being in the city. Okay, Everyone, yeah. we all say that. I think it's because we, yeah, I don't know. I've, Where are we? We and. must have been on the same. See? See, I'm saying the same of the world. Let's oh go to God. the next one here. Okay. Okay, which one do you believe it is? Looney Tunes. Is it tunes, like a funky tune, T-U-N-E-S, or is it tunes like cartoons, T-O-O-N-S? Can I look over there? Yeah, of course. I can, okay. Um, oh, my gosh. Oh, wait a minute. I want to say... Which okay, here's the thing. Correct. Oh, gosh. I want to say the one on the left, the Looney Tunes, like the music tune. Yeah. It is? You're right. Oh, oh hey! Been on the other side of the world when that one happened. How about you? Did, what, I no no. I thought it was tunes. I thought it was cartoons, like Looney. See, that's what I. Okay. Tunes. Okay. So I you, really thought it was. And what's funny is that like the show had nothing to do with music. So why didn't they? Oh. You know. I think because they played music. So in my mind, but, but you're right. It doesn't have. Okay. Hello. All cartoons play music. All right. Next one. <laughs> oh my god. Next one. Can I look? Okay. It? Yeah. You can look at it. Which one is the Volvo symbol? Okay. Well, hold on a second. I remember the one on the left without the thingy, but I did see something recently with the one on, with the arrow with the, like the isn't like the Mercury symbol or something. It's the male symbol or the male symbol. So it's the one on the it's the it's the one with the arrow right or the male symbol right? Or no, I don't know. Oh my gosh! You have I'm to give so me confused. an answer. The uh, the the one on the right, the one with the male symbol. The one with the male symbol. Yeah. Yes, you're correct. Okay, and I'm sorry. The only <laughs> reason why is because I I saw a commercial the other day. Hey, <laughs> you're paying attention. Okay, I'm sorry. I don't watch Next it. one. Okay, oh look at this. Gosh. Which one is correct? They both look the same. Um, there's there's the dash. That's the difference. Oh. Oh my gosh. Don't read. I'm not reading the one. <laughs> <You're> on, cheating. <laughs> I mean, the one with the dash. Nope. It's the one without the dash. It's the one without the dash. Oh. Okay. <laughs> you remember it wrong. Next one. Oh my gosh. Are you Which sure? one is the? Uh, yeah. Okay, this is wow. I know. Which one is the Monopoly guy? The one with the glasses, right? This one with the one with the with the yeah. what is it called? A monocle? Yes. No. Oh my god! No way. <laughs> okay, no, dude, no, no, no. He did not no have way. a monocle. No way. No way. We, we all confuse him with the peanuts guy, the Mr. Peanut no guy. No way. Yep. No way. I swear. No, I that's swear. a Mandela thing. That's, that's a Mandela, Mandela thing. thing. Because in my world, that is it, oh, my in planet. Her world. Okay, that thing has a thing. Because that's what I thought he was. Oh my god! No, okay, I'm freaking. Never, out. never had the monocle. We're almost done here. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's see what else we have. Wow. Okay, which one is Pikachu? Oh, Pikachu. Um, the one without the. Black on the tail? Good. Oh, okay, yay! Yeah. I don't know why. I would have said the one with the black on the I tail. I wanted to. I always see that. I, I wanted to, but for it some reason. It looks right, doesn't it? Yes, and that's why I didn't pick it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. She's learning. Uh, okay. She's learning. <laughs> okay, I have to think with Okay, see now, okay, now this was one, this Berenstain Bears. Yeah. This was the one that started the thing, but to be quite honest with you, I thought it was... This one, the Berenstein. The Berenstein. Yeah, Berenstein. What the heck is a stain? Berenstein. I think every single one of us thinks it's Bernstein. Like, I read yes. the book. I could have sworn there was an E. Yes. What is a Bernstein? What's a stain? A exactly. Bernstein. <laughs> I don't want to know. And you think kids can pronounce a Bernstein? You know, come it's on. It's true. Bernstein. That's insane. Like, there was another one. I don't know if you have. There was one about the Bible. Like there was a verse in the Bible that was oh, no, like. I don't oh know my that gosh, one. that sounds interesting. There was this one. I don't remember, but it was like the verse in the Bible. They were saying that it, there was a conspiracy that the words that they had used was not like from the times. But you know how the Bible has been rewritten. In yeah, it's always translations yeah. and stuff. I mean, Jesus wasn't the name of that man. Yeah, because the letter J. Exactly. What was that like the seventeenth, sixteenth century? Yeah, that they actually developed the letter J. So exactly. So people rewrite it. So that one, but it did for me up. But the. But I mean, who knows? Who knows if they're where we are, whatever, what, how, what parallel universe we are at this moment? Absolutely. Who knows? Who knows? So this stuff is kind of fun. It's cool because it kind of freaks you it out. Is. Because it makes you think, 
Whoa. Where have I been? <laughs> or, you know, it's they, uh, actually they call it cognitive dis- blah, 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 blah. cognitive dissonance, where your brain n- thinks it knows something and then it learns something or somebody tells something it's something and it's so like, oh my gosh, Mind it hurts blown. my brain because I don't get it or I can't, I don't understand like what's happening. Because of information you already have. Exactly. That's so that insane. Is interesting. Insane. That is interesting. Insane. So we want to hear from you. Like, have you ever had any of these Mandela effects symptoms? I'm sure you have. Or do you come from a parallel universe <laughs> and want to share your story or anything? You know, you have any questions or comments? Sure, yeah. You can always email us at believe at believe.love. So it's believe at believe.love. Um, with questions, concerns, or topics. If you guys want us to jump into any particular thing, we're here. We're we here want to meet help. you, too. And we would love to meet you. We're yeah. going to be doing live shows coming up very soon. Very, very, very soon. We want to connect with you guys yeah. and engage with you guys and see what's going on with uh, with our audience. We, we would chat love, with you. love to chat with you guys. Yeah. Thank you so much for joining Thank us. Thank you for joining us, and we'll see That's you again soon. Yay! <laughs> Bye.